Over this past year, reflecting on what this man said to me that February night, the things that have surfaced are chilling. Even as I say this now, things and events are happening that this man talked about. And I know that there will be more. I'm hoping that the corporate greed of the movie industry and its depravity will, in its irony, sell this documentary interview because of its flashy, disgusting glorification of the adversary's darkness. If you're hearing or reading this, then greed has, yet again, prevailed. Simply releasing the interview footage, which may be done in the future, would not draw the masses to watch it, but this jazzed up, creepy version would. Going through the footage was harder than the interview, feeling that evil again, but every curse can be turned into a blessing, and completing this movie has made me a stronger Christian. I have a relationship now with Jesus Christ, baptized, saved, made whole again. I will never make art without God as the hero. As far as Johnny, I do believe everything that this man said, and I do believe he was asking for forgiveness. Whether or not he finds salvation is between him and God. This is my interview with John Trentalan, aka Johnny Lang. The Mafia only exists because the government lets it, and the government only exists because the Mafia protects it. 